G'day guys, we're here in the chop shop today. Got the RVM3 here with its uh, look from World Time Attack Challenge. We've got Jamie over the other side. He's from Wrapped FX and he is uh, doing a brand new livery on the car. So uh, we're gonna get straight into it. He's gonna do the other side. I'm not gonna show you what it is yet. So I'll rip all this off and, uh, and then we'll get cracking into the new look and yeah, well Jamie's gonna get cracking on it, so. <laughs> Let's do it. So the wrap's done, and I'm not gonna show you guys, even though you pretty well got the gist of it from seeing the time lapse, but I think we'll do the final reveal of it out in the sun. Cause it'll look a hell of a lot better. And I'm freaking pumped with it, to be honest. It's, yeah. It turned out really good, didn't it, Brunners? Yeah. I'd show you Brie, but she's cleaning the car, and I don't wanna show you the car just yet. So the whole, Backstory behind the livery. Uh, I hit up Mark Curran from New Zealand who owns Pixelsaurus and he I don't know how his brain works, but it just absolutely nailed it So I sent him a picture of a BMW old-school livery uh, And then I sent him a picture of I can't remember something else and I basically said to him I want to bring the squid back, but not in a massive way just a really subtle way, but also retaining the BMW heritage sort of look. Uh, because this weekend, um, we are doing the Adelaide Motorsport Festival. It's based around all the vintage side of motorsport and the complete history of motorsport. So there'll be everything from old school cars all the way through to new school. And I really think this is now gonna pop in front of all those other cars in the field. So it's, um, it's awesome. It's actually turned out a lot better than what I thought it was gonna look. And I've also got Two of my biggest supporters uh, on the car in a very big way for this weekend, and uh, I'm excited about that. So anyway, let's cut to checking this thing out in the sun. You ready, Brunners? Yeah. All right, let's cut.
there's the new look. And uh, I've got to admit, it's probably my most favorite one. <laughs> I just uh, did a live uh, video call with Cheer, the owner of Powertune, and he was blown away. So uh, that entire ordeal was just made then by seeing his reaction. So uh, it's freaking awesome. I'm pumped with it. So massive thanks to obviously Mark over in New Zealand. Uh, from Pixelsaurus for designing it and then also Jamie from Wrapped FX here in South Australia. He uh, put the livery on and he smashed it out this morning. Uh, so yeah, huge thanks buddy. And um, if you guys are looking for designs or if you want someone to install the wrap or do whole car wraps, I'll chuck their uh, links down below uh, for obviously Jamie at Wrapped FX and then also uh, Mark if you're looking for a new design and his Creative brain is ridiculous. So uh, yeah, Pixel Saurus is his business and I'll chuck that below as well. So huge thanks again to those guys and uh, obviously a massive thanks to Powertune Australia and MTAA Super for their continued support. So uh, it's near all ready to rock. Just put all new fluids through the car, new diff, oil, gearbox oil, engine oil, and uh, yeah, fill it up with fuel, brand new tires, and we are ready to go for tomorrow's drift demo in the city of Adelaide. This is like going to be ridiculous drifting on Rundle Road right next to Rundle Street. And uh, yeah, I'll be doing that four times, pretty much one after another in between the Brabham. That's going to be doing uh, a timed circuit around there. So I might even do one run to try and beat it. We'll see how we go because that thing's got, or it's, or I'm sure it's got terrible lock and this thing will be able to get around. Uh, the big barrels they got there a lot quicker I'd say but we'll see I might get too excited and just want to burn some rubber but yeah that's it for today guys thanks heaps for watching and uh, I hope you like the new look as much as I do see you guys